Hi, Duke. Hi, how are you today? I'm good, thank you. How are you today, Duke? <clears throat> um, very good, thank you. And what did you do today, Duke? Are you on holiday now or are you busy with exams, tests? Uh, today I have <clears throat> today I have an exam in school. Oh, and how was the exam? Was it easy? Uh, no, it's uh, very hard. It's hard. Okay. When do you go on holiday? When is your holiday? Uh, next month. Next oh. month. So June. Your holiday is in June. So you're busy with exams now? Yes. Okay. Let's see, I need to do this. Okay, what did you eat today, Duke? Uh, today I ate uh, rice with chicken and uh, vegetable. Oh, and how's your weather? Uh, today the weather is uh, sunny and hot. Oh, nice. Is it winter or summer now? Uh, it's uh, summer now. It's summer now. Okay. Okay, Duke, introduce yourself. What's your name? My name is Duke. Okay, introduce yourself. What's your name? Okay, when we introduce ourselves, we don't just say, my name is Liesl. That doesn't tell me much. It tells me your name, but you don't, you're not introducing yourself. My name is Duke, and what's your second name? Do you have a surname uh, or a second No, I, I know. What is it? I now have a second name. You only have two? You don't have like your surname? Uh, no. So you, no man, you must have surnames. You don't have surnames in Vietnam? No. Oh, you only have one name? Yes. Oh, that's interesting. You know what surname is? Do you know the word surname? Uh, what what did it say? Do you know surname? You must have a surname. Here. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, uh, I don't. Tên và họ. Tên và họ. Tên và họ. Tên và họ. You don't have that? Uh, I have. Sorry, uh, I listen a uh, second name. Yes, what is that? Uh, it's um, Ming Ming Du. Oh, okay. Okay, so let's say my name is Manduk. Let's have this, okay. Yeah. I am, how old are you? I'm 17. Okay, I am 17 years old. I am 17 years old and from Vietnam. I am currently, I'm currently in grade. What grade are you? 9, 10, 11 at school? Mm.
What grade are you in? Uh, uh, 10. 10, okay. So I am in grade 10. I am in grade 10 at, what's the school's name? Um, L L V T school. L V T. Yes. Um. Okay. Do you have brothers and sisters? Uh, I have. I have one brother and one sister. And where are you? Are you the eldest? Are you the youngest? Are you in the middle? Uh, uh, can you repeat? Are you the youngest or the oldest? I, I oldest. My name is Minh Duc. I am 17 years old and from Vietnam. I'm currently in grade 10 at LVT. Okay, that's all you have to say. Right, next question. What would you like to be in the future and why? What would you like to be in the future and why? I would like to be a doctor in the future. Recording. Why? Uh, because I can help people. Okay, why, what doctor do you want to be? Uh, I would like to be a doctor in the future. What doctor do you want to be? There's lots of doctors. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. I would like to... I would like to become a doctor in the future. So you want to be a GP? So like a family doctor, do you want to be a doctor of the eyes? Do you want to be a doctor of the legs, of the foot, of the head? Do you want to work in the hospital or do you want to work in the office? Uh, I like to work at a hospital. So you want to be in the operations? So you want to operate. What do you want to specialize uh, in? Do you want to specialize in like the bones of your body or the muscles? Or what do you want to do as a doctor? Um, uh, I think I want to be... Uh, uh, yes. uh, I don't know. Can I have an example? Okay, you must go think what doctor you want to be, okay? Mm, yes. Um, I would like to become a doctor in the future. Um, I, um, enjoy helping people. Um, I enjoy having people who, uh, vitally needs help, needs medical help. Uh, Um, 
So you can also say, uh, when I visit the doctor, I, I would like to become a doctor in the future. I enjoy helping people who vitally need medical help. When, uh, uh, when I, um, let's say, my house doctor um, inspired me when I was little. Um, I enjoy having people who vitally need help. Um, and I did help. And my goal is to improve their lives and health. My house often inspired me when I was little, as he always um, took care of people needing it the most. Okay, I would like to become a doctor in the future. I enjoy, I can say here because in the future, because I would like to become a doctor in the future because I enjoy helping people who vitally needs medical help and my goal needs medical help here. My goal, my goal is to improve their lives and health. My house doctor inspired me when I was little, as he always took care of people needing it the most. Okay, so that's that one. Okay, our next question is, what is your hobby? What is your hobby? Um, my hobby is um, playing computer game and uh, play football um, with my friend. You like to play football with your friends? Yeah. Okay, why? Because uh play because playing computer game um uh, when I play computer game I feel relaxed and I not playing Football with my friend because um, football have me strong. It makes you strong, okay. And when do you play it? I play it when I have a free time. On weekends? I play it when I have a free time. Is that every day or on weekends? When usually do you play? Oh, at the weekend. Oh, at the weekends. Okay. Okay. Um. So tell me again, what's your hobby? Uh, I like playing football with my friend. At uh, when I have free time at the weekend, uh, because playing football have me strong and I feel very, uh, relaxing when I play football with my friend at school. Okay, I want to type that for you. Um. Uh...
So, my hobby is playing football. Yes? Yes. Okay, so my hobby is playing football. I enjoy playing football on weekends with my friends. It is a very social game, which also keeps me fit and healthy. Okay, what is your name? Uh, my name is Mingyu. Uh, I'm 17 years old and I'm from Vietnam. I'm currently? Uh, I'm currently in red 10 at uh, LVT. What would you like to be in the future? I would like to I would like to become a doctor in the future because I enjoy uh, helping people who obviously need um medic medicine help. My goal is to improve their lives and health. My house doctor in inspired me when I was uh, little as he always took care of people needing his most. What is your hobby? My hobby is playing football. I enjoy playing football on weekends with my friend. It's a very uh, Circle game, which also keeps me fit and healthy. Okay, what is your name? My name is Mingyu. I'm 17 years old. I'm currently in grade 10 at uh, LVT. What would you like to be in the future and why? I would like to become a doctor in the future because I enjoy helping people who vitally need medical help. My goal is to improve their lives and health. My house doctor inspired me when I was little as he always took care of people needing it the most. What is your hobby? <laughs> Um, my hobby is my hobby is playing football. Uh, I enjoy playing football on weekends with my friends. It's a very circular game, which also keeps me fit and healthy. Yeah. Okay. Hey, what is your name? Uh, my name is Mingyu. I'm, seven years, I'm 17 years old and from Vietnam. I am currently in grade 10 at LVT. Uh, what is your hobby? Uh, my hobby is playing football. I enjoy playing football on weekends with my friend. It's a very uh, secure game, which also keeps me fit and healthy.
What do you want to be in the future and why? I would like to become a doctor in the future because I love helping people who really need medical help. My goal is to improve their life and health. And health. My house doctor inspired me when I was a little as he always took care of people needing his most. Okay. Okay. Now we're going to do this one. Um, so this one says. Describe the international organization that you like the most. Which international organization do you like the most? Uh, I don't know. Let me type it here. Describe the international organization that you like the most. You should say what the name of the organization is. When was it formed? What are its responsibilities, activities, and aims, and probably why you like it? Uh, okay. Describe the international organization that you like the most, what the name of the organization is, when was it formed, what are its responsibilities, activities, aims, and why you like it. Okay. Um, okay, which organization do you like? Uh, I don't, I don't know. Uh, I don't know or Asian. Okay. Oh, sorry, I have a foot. Describe the international. So you're not using, you don't like any international organization? Uh, I, I don't know. How do you I not know? You don't, you don't know any international organization? Yes. Um, what about the university or the places in America that you want to see? Nothing that you want to know or see? Mm, I don't know. Some university has no.
Um, so are there no international companies in Vietnam? What international companies are there in Vietnam? Uh, uh, I, I don't know. There's no there's no international companies in Vietnam. It's difficult if you don't have anything to tell me. Um Is there any international companies or shops or organizations in Vietnam? Uh, yes. There is? Okay, tell me about them. Remember, international is when there's members from more than one nation. So international means when you do maybe business with Russia or you do business with America or you do business with the Netherlands. Um, there must be a there must be an international company in Vietnam. Uh, is a uh, organization in international? Uh, I I think I think uh, I know. Uh, W-A-O. Okay, let's talk about... Um... thinking okay is there any there's no companies you that you know no no That makes it diffi very, very difficult to help you with this answer because you can't just say no. So there's no international companies in your country? There must be. Because Vietnam, you can't tell me that there's no international companies. There must be international companies. So you must go look for them. Uh, there are numerous national and international companies in my country. You must go and find them, okay? Today, I am going to talk about an organization I would like to be part of. The name of the organization is, and then you have to tell what the organization is. You say what it is and you explain what they do. Um, then you say where they are. So, let me get this away. So then you say the name of the organization, you explain what, you explain what they do and you explain uh, where they are in the world. Where in the world do they have offices? Uh, yeah, let's go find places for you. Um, or we're gonna international. 
organizations in Vietnam. Okay, let's see. United Nations is Nations is in Vietnam. Okay, so you, uh, Vietnam is part of the ASEAN. That is the Association of South East Asian Nations and subsequently a member of the, okay, let's see if there's more. Where where you write? Uh, I don't see. Um, I'm writing on the whiteboard. You must just press a button. I don't know if you can see it on a phone or on an iPhone. I don't know if you can see it there. AAV, Action Aid Vietnam. That's also an international company. Academic Academy for Educational Development. That's also, um, so there's lots of them. K in Vietnam. Child Fund in Vietnam. Catholic Release. You have to go choose one. There's lots of them there. Uh, okay, you'll have, you'll have to give me an answer. I can't. We can't do this if you can't help me. So you have to choose about organization that you are interested in or that you like. You have to say what the name is. So go on your phone and Google international companies in Vietnam, and then you have to choose one. Then we're going to explain what they do and where they are in the world. Uh, Can yes, you do that? Uh, w, uh, w A O. W A O. What is that for? What does that stand for? What's W A O? Do? No, what? What does this WAO stand for? World Health Organization. Okay, now we can work. World Health Organization. Okay, World Health Organization. So let's carry on here. Okay, is World Health Organization W W Oh W H O yes. Oh yes. Oh okay. Um. The name of the organization is World Health Organization. Okay. What do they do? What do you know about this company? <laughs> I don't know. You don't know what they do? Yes, I don't know what they do. Where is the company in Vietnam? Oh, can you repeat? Where is the company in Vietnam? Uh, uh, this topic is a uh, talk about the uh, organization I like most. 
uh, it don't talk about organization in Vietnam. It can in the world. Yes. Okay, so where are they? Where is the office then? Who? Where is the offices uh, of the organization? You have to do some research. I can't give everything for you. You, It's your yeah. question, not my question. You need to answer. I don't have to answer. And you can't say to the teacher, I don't know. You're going to get zero points. You're going to fail their exam. You have to prepare. Do research. Look for stuff. Look for answers. So if you say you like the World Health Organization, you need to know about them, what they do, where they are, where is the main office, how many offices they have worldwide. What, you have to tell me wh why you like them. Okay, you need to know. So you have to go Google these these answers. So now I need you to go and find them. Where are they in the world? Where is the office? There must be one main focus office. Are they in America or in Vietnam or in China? They have, st and when did they start? Geneva, okay. Now, you have to tell me when did they start? Which year? Which Um, can you repeat? When did they start? When did the organization start? Which year? Uh, it start at uh, uh, Okay, moreover, the head office is located in Geneva. There are 194. Countries. Oh, I see. Um, There are 194 member states part of this organization. The organization started in nineteen forty eight. within the United States.